Hello, my name is Amy Edgar and welcome to my channel. Today we're doing the review on this stick foundation from Hourglass. So as of this morning, I absolutely love how it looks, how it sits on the skin. Absolutely beautiful. Okay, so this stick foundation, the packaging is beautiful. Check this out. It's just like sleek and pretty and shiny and I love the shape. It's just a lot of fun. So when you open up the stick foundation, you roll it up, of course, and as I applied it, it went on really easy. I did do a, a review on another stick foundation that just felt like it was sitting on top of the skin, and I really didn't like that feel. So as of this morning, the Hourglass Stick Foundation does not feel like it's sitting on top of the skin. It feels like it's kind of melted into the skin like other foundations or like liquid foundations. So, so far I'm pretty impressed with this Hourglass Stick Foundation, but we're gonna see if I'm really impressed by end of day. So we'll do an all day wear test, see how this baby does and see if it's worth your money. So here we go. I like how this is sitting on the skin. It looks really pretty so far. And I'm hoping that this could be the first stick foundation that works for me. So we're gonna see how this lasts throughout the day at the end of the day, then we'll do kind of a circle around and see how this does. So let's stay tuned. Okay, so it's end of business day. And how did this hourglass foundation work? Well, pretty good for a stick foundation, I think. Again, I'm not, um, my only experience with the stick foundation was with one other brand and it was not good. I did not blot, I did not add additional powder. So this is what you get after a business day and some hot weather. Basically, what I see that has happened is you can tell where my glasses were sitting right here on either side, but I've actually had other foundation actually rub it away totally to the skin and this just kind of has a little bit of an outline from where my glasses were. My chin and nose did surprisingly well, and I know I've messed with my face today, and it still is holding up pretty good. The only thing that really, and I do have a little bit where it rubbed away where my glasses were, I didn't blot. So this, you know, the oils that are showing through my skin is from a normal work day. I did not blot, I did not use powders, so this is how much oil came through, which is quite a bit of oil. So maybe if I had the opportunity to blot through the day and I wasn't doing an all day wear test, I think it would look really nice probably right now, I'm guessing, because it really didn't wear away like some other foundations. So overall, I'm pretty impressed with this stick foundation, considering I've not had good luck with the only other stick foundation. Overall, I'd say it, that I like this Hourglass. It's, um, it does show a lot of oil through, but again, today has been a really super hot day, so I'm not surprised, but it held up well considering. Way to go, Hourglass. Thank you so much for watching my channel today. I hope you enjoyed this review on the Hourglass Stick Foundation. If you did like this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed, please consider subscribing or refer me to a friend. And as always, you have a choice, so make it a beautiful day. Until next time.